Hey, what is up, you guys, and welcome back to It's Magical Panicorn. In today's video, I will be going on a shopping spree and buying every single item from the Summerfest shop in Adopt Me. So, you guys, before we get started, make sure to hit the subscribe button, leave a like on today's video, and turn on that notification bell so you won't miss out on any awesome videos. Alright, you guys, so let's go ahead and get started. Okay, guys, so you heard me right. I'll be buying every single item from here. And oh my goodness, you guys, I've been saving up beach balls since the very first week of this event. And my goal was to earn about 100k beach balls per week. And this event was four weeks. And I ended up earning about 413,000 beach balls. So honestly, I think I did pretty good, you know. So um, let's go ahead and get started with the shopping spree. So first off, I am going to go ahead and start with the pet accessories. All right, so the first item here is the star sunglasses. And it is common, but look at how cute it is, you guys. I love it you guys i usually don't buy like that many pet accessories but i do want to kind of get closer to completing my journal even though i'm like really far away and um yeah getting these accessories would really help so um let's go ahead and do it for 450 beach balls all right the next accessory is the duck floaty which is ultra rare and it costs 3750 beach balls this is also a really cute pet, pet accessory. Um, I love it. Just a little duck on your pet's back, and that's just super cute. So let's go ahead and buy it. Woo! Okay, up next is the flowery sun hat. It is uncommon, and it only costs 850 beach balls. So that's pretty good. You know, this hat is really detailed, really cool. So um, let's go ahead and buy it. Also, you guys, I will show all these accessories on a pet later on. So yeah, once I buy all of them, I'll put it on like a really cute pet and see how these look. Okay, so this is probably the most expensive pet accessory. It is the shark swim cap. It's ultra rare, and it costs 4,000 beach balls, you guys. That's really cute. It's almost like a shark pet is on your... Like a shark pet is on top of your pet. <laughs> if that even makes any sense. But look at that. It's like eating the dog. Oh my goodness. All right. Super, super awesome. All right. Next, we have the summer straw hat. It is a rare item, and it costs 2,000 beach balls. Oh my goodness, you guys, this is probably the funniest accessory ever. It is diving fins. It is a rare item. Honestly, for me, it looks like duck fins, you know. It kind of looks like that. It doesn't really look like fin. It looks more like the, like a duck feet. Like, if you put this on, like, a duck or something, that would look really cute. I'm definitely going to try it out later on. Okay, we also have a lei. This is a common, and it's like a Hawaiian lei. It looks really awesome, and it's actually really cheap. So it's 400 beach balls. Let's go ahead and get it, you guys. Oh my goodness, I'm already down to 400,000 beach balls. My money is going by so fast. Okay, this is another common, and it is the drinks cooler, you guys. So it's basically a cooler for drinks. Probably not the cutest accessory, but that's okay. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and buy it for six hundred beach balls. All right, and our last accessory is a beach umbrella, and it is uncommon for five hundred beach balls. Ooh, super cute. All right, you guys. So I just bought every single pet accessory, but let's go ahead and try it on on a pet. Okay, so I am, of course, going to use my panda. Um, little sneak peek. I'm working on making a neon panda for a video, you guys. So that's pretty cool. All right, let me take out Panicorn here. The iconic Panicorn with the horn. And I don't know, some other accessories on it. But let's go ahead and take that all off. And let's go ahead and try on the new summer accessories on Panicorn. All right, um, let me see here. Oops, it doesn't really sort. Okay, here's the drinks cooler. Let me go ahead and see that. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. I mean, probably not the best one. It looks kind of funny, honestly. <laughs> it looks like it's gonna fall out. Like, look at the ice. That looks like it's gonna fall out. Um, probably not my favorite accessory, but that's okay. All right, let me go ahead and try on the other ones. Let me see here. It's kind of hard to find them. Um, I don't know. I have a lot of head accessories. I have a lot of these pins. I probably need to get rid of some of those. Um, okay, let me sort by like hats. Okay, here is the shark swim cap. And this one actually looks pretty cool. Probably not the best on the panda, but like on a shark puppy, that would look pretty cool. And I'm going to be buying the shark puppy later, so I might try this one on. All right, next we have star sunglasses here. Um, let me go ahead and take this off. Okay, there we go, you guys. So, oops, my panda is sick now. Okay. Um, but that looks pretty cool, you know, star sunglasses. Okay, my pet is sick. That's not really good. Let me go ahead and take out another pet, you guys, because that kind of messes up the entire accessory. But all right, let me go ahead and do this. Okay, so next we have the Hawaiian Lei, you guys. And whoa, this is probably my favorite, like, summer accessory. I know it is a common, but honestly, it looks really good. <laughs> All right, so here is what the summer straw hat looks like. Pretty good. I love, like, the pink bow on the back. That definitely adds to the detail of the hat, so that's really cool. And then I think we had one more hat. Um, Okay, it wasn't that one. That's the walrus hat. Uh, oh, it was right here. The flowery sun hat, you guys. Pretty cute, you guys. In, in my um, opinion, I kind of like this one more, the summer straw hat, just because it looks better. Um, But both are really cute. 
And lastly are those little like fins over there. I did want to try on a duck. I don't even know. Is there a duck pet? There is. There's like the happy duckling. I don't even know where this is from. But um, yeah, there's this pet. I want to try on the fins on this because I feel like that would be pretty cute. Over right, here it is, you guys. And whoa, oh my goodness. That just looks like so natural, you guys. Like here is without it and with it. Oh my goodness. That's this is just meant for this pet, you guys. These fins are totally meant for the duck. And just look at how much better that looks, you guys. Oh my goodness. I absolutely love it. Okay, that was really cool. But now let's move on to something even more awesome that you guys have been waiting for. The pet, you guys. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is where really all my money is going to drain and all my beach balls are going to go. But that's okay. It will be definitely worth it. Okay, guys. So first up, we have the flying fish. And it is a common pet for 3,750 beach balls. But before I buy that, I do want to tell you guys how much every single item in this shop costs, like the total cost in beach balls. This will not be including the Robux items, but everything that costs beach balls, the pet accessories, the pets, the vehicles, and toys. The total amount is 636,100 beach balls, you guys. Oh my goodness, that is so expensive for every single item. I mean, that's basically one of every single item in the store. So um, yeah, it's pretty expensive, but you know, that is everything. So I mean pretty cool so i just wanted to tell you guys how much it would cost in case you want to get one of every single item all right now let's go ahead and buy the flying fish here's what it looks like i actually made a neon of this but i did trade it away so i do already know what this looks like it looks really cool honestly this is the cheapest pet from the event um i really like it so i definitely want to get more but before i do that i want to i need to buy everything before i can start buying duplicates of stuff but look at this you guys it is a common but i absolutely love it like the color and everything blends really well together Alright guys, next up is the mini mackerel. I'm going to save this for the end. Um, this one costs 60,000 beach balls and I'm pretty sure it is an ultra rare. This one right here is probably one of the most unique pets just because it's like a school of fish. There's like nine of them right here and no other pet has like nine of anything. They're all just like one basic pet. So this one is definitely unique and I feel like this one will become pretty rare in the future. So let's go ahead and buy it for 60,000 beach balls. Go! Oh my goodness, you guys, I've never bought this pet before. Just look at that. Like, if I walk around, there's like nine fish following me. That's so cool. And also, if I pick it up, look at that. It looks like I'm just holding like a bunch of fish. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's really adorable, you guys. And is it ultra rare? Yes, it is an ultra rare pet. All right, you guys, now it's time to buy the legendary shark puppy. And this one costs 100,000 beach balls. And guys, this is not even the most expensive pet. There's one pet over there that's even more expensive. But um, this one's really cute. This was the first legendary pet added to the event. Um, not counting the Robux one. And look at that, you guys. It's so adorable. So let's go ahead and buy it for 100,000 beach balls. Oh my goodness, you guys. I bought it. Look at that. It's so adorable. I love it how it has like one tooth sticking out. That's just really cute. <laughs> look at that, you guys. It walks really cool and it follows me around. That's awesome. I love this pet. Okay, there's also the hot doggo. I don't want to buy it right now, but I do have one, so I do want to show you guys. I have a rideable one right here, and here's what it looks like, you guys. Let me go ahead and ride it, and oh my goodness. This is also a really cute pet. This is a Robux pet that costs 600 Robux, you guys. So if you guys do want to get this pet, make sure you get it before this event leaves in one day. This is also a really unique pet. It's basically a hot dog, but there's actually a dog inside, so yeah, that's really cute. I love this pet. All right, next up, we're going to the week two area here. And we too just added like three new pets and some vehicles. Um, I calculated my beach balls and I do want to get every single pet accessory, pet, and toy. So I am going to skip out the vehicles just because, I don't know, the vehicles just aren't that special to me in my opinion. So um, yeah, I just want to focus on the pets and the toys and the accessories. Okay guys, so week two, there was a Tortuga de la Isla, and this was 490 Robux. Um, unfortunately, I don't have one, and I don't plan on buying one right now, but um, maybe in the future I'll try to trade for one. Okay guys, so right here we have the Uncommon Lobster that costs 11,000 beach balls. Let me go ahead and buy it. Again, I've never bought this pet before, and I've never really seen it, like, um, besides right here. So let's go ahead and buy it. All right, you guys. So here's what it looks like. All oh, really cute. Um, probably not like my favorite pet, but I do love it. You know, it kind of reminds you of like a crab or something. I know they look different, but like the color and everything kind of looks similar. As you guys can see, here's what a crab looks like. Obviously, they do look different. This is like the exact same crab from the mini game, so that's pretty cool. But um, the colors really match, so that's pretty, you know, that's interesting. But here's what it looks like. It is uncommon, and yeah, pretty cute. Now we've made it to the most expensive pet in this entire event, the Levithon. All right, you guys. So this pet costs 130,000 beach balls, you guys. 
Oh my goodness, that is so many beach balls, you guys. So let's go ahead and buy it. It is a legendary pet, and it looks really cool. This is also a unique pet as well. All right, you guys, let's go ahead and buy it. Three, two, one. Bye now. All right, we did it, you guys. And whoa, oh my goodness, this pet actually looks really big compared to the other ones. And again, it is a legendary pet. Here it is. And oh my goodness, that's so cute, you guys. Oh, look how when I hold it, it just like wraps its arms together. That's really cute. Okay, I'm really happy about this pet. And wow, you guys, now I'm down to 94,000 beach balls. All right, guys, let's continue to the week three stuff right here. So week three honestly didn't have too much. It just had the hermit crab boxes, which I absolutely love. I have some more on my alt account, but I just don't have enough to buy a bunch of them if I would. If I could, I would, but that's okay. So I'm just going to buy one of those, and we'll open it up. And then over here for week three, there was a leopard shark. That cost 25,000 beach balls. So again, I've never bought this pet before, so let me go ahead and buy it. Okay, guys, here is what it looks like. Again, like Adopt Me, this event is coming up with a lot of unique pets, a lot of different pets, and that's really awesome. You know, they're making the game more interesting that way. And look at this, you guys. It is a leopard shark. I mean, the colors, you know, are kind of dark, but that's okay, you know. I love it still. It, it matches really well. All right, guys, so now I'm just going to buy one Hermit Crab Boxes. The Hermit Crab Boxes cost 12,000 beach balls, and you have a 60% chance of getting it in Uncommon. So you basically have no chance of getting it in Common, so you're guaranteed an Uncommon, which is pretty good. You have a 25% chance of getting a rare, a 10% chance of getting an ultra rare, and a 5% chance of getting the legendary. Alright guys, so here is the uncommon hermit crab, the rare castle hermit crab, the ultra rare ice cream hermit crab, and the legendary pirate hermit crab. Alright guys, so let me go ahead and buy this for 12,000 beach balls. Woo! Alright you guys, so also if you guys like don't want to open these, I recommend saving them just because they might become rare after the event and people would overpay for these boxes a lot, just like the other boxes. So um, yeah, if you have enough beach balls, I would recommend saving some. But for the video, I'm going to go ahead and open it. 3, 2, 1, go! Oh my goodness you guys, what am I going to get, man? Oh, I just got a regular hermit crab, but that's okay, it's still super adorable. Alright guys, so I do also have one of each of these hermit crabs that I do want to show you guys. Um, and I also do have a neon hermit crab like the regular one. So I just want to show you guys here is what it looks like. And oh my goodness, that's really cute. Um, I didn't name this one, I traded for it. Uh, I didn't actually have to trade that much. I traded like one lunar box for it. So um, yeah, make sure to save the boxes because they'll be worth a lot in the future. But look at this, you guys. That's really cute. I love how the shell glows. This would look really cool mega as well. I just don't know how long that would take. It would take a while to be aging all that. Um, but that's okay. So here's the rare castle hermit crab, you guys. Also really adorable. I love like the golden on the face. It looks really awesome. And then now for my favorite hermit crab, the ice cream one, you guys. This one like really re reminds me of the ice cream mini game and just the ice cream shop in general. And honestly, the sprinkles and everything just really puts this pet together. And I just love this pet. Honestly, the pastel colors, it's just really awesome. All right, you guys. So here for the legendary pirate hermit crab, here is what it looks like, you guys. And oh my goodness, you guys, it looks really cool. The name is kind of covering some of the detail, but look at that. There's a flag and there's like the steering wheel right there. And this pet just has so much detail. It's definitely a legendary and it looks really awesome all right guys so let's keep going and this is the week for probably like the least the, um, the week with the least amount of stuff but that's okay it was the last week of the event and you know that was still really cool all right guys so let's go ahead and buy the happy clam for fifty thousand beach balls and i just realized this one this one costs nine thousand beach balls and only at fifty seven thousand but i do have some more beach balls on my alt account and i will go ahead and buy that right after this so here's the happy clam you guys it costs fifty thousand beach balls and it's pretty cute you know let's go ahead and buy it and oh my goodness i only have seven thousand beach balls remaining um but here is what it looks like you guys that looks really awesome Okay, so there is also some toys I want to buy over there, but let me go ahead and go on my alt account and um, buy this Arctic Turn so I can show you guys the rest of the pets. Alright guys, so I am on my alt account right here, and um, I do have about 116,000 beach balls, which you know is pretty good. I didn't realize I had that much, but let's go ahead and buy the Arctic Turn for 9,000 beach balls. Oh my goodness, you guys, that looks pretty cool. Um, I think this is like the second least expensive pet, so that's really awesome. Um, let's see, is it... It's an uncommon pet, you guys, so that's pretty cool. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and trade this over. Actually, I can just give it to my main account. And then, yeah, officially, I will have every single pet from the summer event besides the Robux turtle over there. But, you know, that's okay. Okay, guys, I'll leave my alt account over there. And now let me go ahead and finish buying the toys. I honestly don't think 7,000 is enough to buy all these. 
um because this one costs like oh my goodness this one costs seven thousand five hundred okay some of these are pretty expensive um so i bring my alt account back but let me go ahead and spend the ones that i can so here is a lemonade chew toy for 500 beach balls let me go ahead and buy that and, Ooh, that's actually really cute i really like that all right that's pretty cool it is an uncommon pet uncommon toy did i say pet yeah uncommon toy um this is a flip-flop the road toy which costs 300 beach balls so let me go ahead and buy that uh, I should probably take out a pet to show you guys how to use it. Uh, let me go ahead and take out, let me take out the, let me take out the clam, you know, let me do that. All right, there we go. Um, ooh, that's pretty cool. It runs really far to go and get it. Okay, um, I'm going to skip this one. How much does this one cost? 5000 All right. Um, all right, let me just buy the cheap ones first. So this one costs 750 beach balls, and it is a sandcastle rattle. Really cute, you guys. Oh, wow. I love how much detail Adami is putting into, like, their items and toys. That looks really awesome. All right, and lastly, I'm just going to go ahead and buy this pinwheel propeller for 5,000 beach balls. Oh, that's actually really cute. Look at me. I can just, like, go up. Oh, my goodness. I can't go all the way up. Look at that. That looks really awesome. All right, guys. I only have 679 beach balls left. I'm just going to buy another one of these just because it's really cute, and I love the lemonade one. All right, so now let's go to finish buying the rest of my toys on my alt account. Okay, Panacorn X BFF is back, and um, let me go ahead and buy the toys I didn't buy. So um, here is the pineapple plush for 7,000 500 beach balls it's super adorable and let me go ahead and buy it and whoa look at that you guys that's so cute and is, is this like a rare or something i feel like it should be rare it's actually ultra rare oh my goodness that's really awesome i love it okay and the last two um pet, pet toys right here is the ship wheel flying disc and the ukulele so let me go ahead and buy the ship wheel flying disc for 2250 beach balls oh that's actually really cool as well Okay, and lastly, the most expensive toy here is the ukulele for 10,000 beach balls. Oh my goodness, that's also really cute. I love, like, the flowers. That's really good detail. Oh, wow, and I can even play it, you guys. <laughs> that's so cool. All right, guys, so as you guys can see right here, I still have 87,000 beach balls. Now, I don't really know what I should buy, honestly. I mean, I could save up and play a couple more mini games and buy another, like, shark puppy. But I kind of want some more of these pets, so I'm really stuck. I don't know what I should buy. Um... I could buy more crab boxes, honestly, but I don't know if that would be the smartest thing to do. All right, guys, so I decided that I'm probably going to go ahead and save up to 100,000 beach balls since I'm honestly not that far away. I'm at 87,000. And, yeah, I'll go ahead and buy that probably off camera, and I'm just going to get one more shark puppy just, you know, to build up my inventory a little bit. Alright guys, so that is going to be the end of today's video. I honestly had so much fun spending all of my beach balls and going on a huge shopping spree. If you guys did enjoy this video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, turn on those post notifications. Also, don't forget to follow me on Roblox to join my games. Thank you guys all so much for watching and I will see you guys all next time. Bye!